This next story will make you hold your loved ones a little bit closer this holiday season. A Port St. Lucie father is hoping to get closure three years after a crime shattered his family forever. News Channel 5's John Shaman is in St. Lucie County tonight where this case has remained unsolved for years. A lot of emotions. James Heiner stands on what is now an empty plot of land off Beach Avenue in Port St. Lucie. We had a lot of great times here. It was once the home of his son, Matthew. This was his backyard and that's where his pontoon boat was docked. On the night of November 10th, 2015, there was a fire. Somehow Matthew could not escape. The next day, James discovered his son's body in the ashes. His death ruled a homicide. There's not a day or night that goes by that I don't still see his burnt skull in that house. Nothing's ever going to change that. Matthew Heiner was a jewelry repairman who made his own custom creations. He was a loving father, loved his brother, sister, mom, dad. Investigators say a safe inside the home was open, but not forced open, making robbery the likely motive. James is frustrated by sleepless nights and the lack of leads. We need justice for Matt, but we need these people off the street. In their son's memory, the family set up a bench in front of the Melbourne Public Library. Matt loved the water so much. When we want to go visit Matt, we go sit on his bench and look at the intercoastal. If you have any information in this case, you're asked to call the St. Lucie County Sheriff's Office. In Port St. Lucie, John Shaneman, WPTV, News Channel 5.